Hi guys, welcome back to another video. Um, this is Kay Coasters. Hi. I'm John, this is Rachel. Yep. And today we have a very special announcement. Yes, an announcement that I am not overly pleased with, but I will be. Yes. Um, so, we have decided to do a charity event, um, technically a two, two charity events. Two charities. Um, However, just one outcome, I suppose. Yeah. Um, so, as you might have heard from my dad's voice, he's not overly, not <laughs> over the moon, is that? Oh, aye. Not best pleased. Yeah. Um, so you, can, you can fall out with daughters. It's allowed. Um, I have decided to make two Just Given pages. Um, one for the MS Society and one for Alzheimer's Scotland and we're going to try and raise money for both charities and in return my dad is going to go on Smiler for the first time at Alton Towers. Why it's called Smiler? Why? Because um, so I, I will come off crying. <laughs> that is the 14 inverting coaster, looping coaster, whatever you want to <laughs> Um... But I've been on it. Amazing ride. Dad has said he's going on it for about the past five years. Has still never went on it. Um, however, yeah, the charities are just really close to us and we would like to do something to give back and do something in return as well. Yeah. Just, I'm not going to whittle on and give you big sob stories or anything like that. The long and the short of it is, my mum has a form of Alzheimer's called vascular dementia. She's had that for, I think, about eight or nine years. And she's now in a, a, kind of a nursing home that specialises for people with this disorder. Also, my wife, Lindsay, she has multiple sclerosis. And again... Horrible debilitating uh, mm -hmm. uh, disease, yeah, and it's it's just the the work that both of these charities do um, is amazing. Yeah. Anything from kind of kind of helping carers out, giving being able to be answering phones twenty four hours mm -hmm. for those that are having a meltdown or. Um, for those that are just needing somebody extra to talk support. to, mm -hmm. um, extra support. Um, there's all the kind of volunteer groups. Um, there's, there's still overheads to pay for hiring out rooms and halls and one thing or to allow these meet, important meetings to ha happen. Um, and as I said, there's there's just so there's there's so much good that they do, yeah. and. With the MS Society, as I said, the MS Society has been so, so helpful to us. Yeah. Uh, we've had to make home adaptions uh, for Lindsay's MS to give her a, a better, kind of, I suppose, quality of life. Yeah. Um, and just to help with easy things. Um, and without, without uh, a bit of help, uh, financial help from them, we would still be saving money uh, yeah. to try to, to get these things done. Um, and as I said, I know Lindsay would be, would want to show her appreciation as well. Um, so I think Lindsay's probably going to be one of the biggest donators of money to get me on, to actually let me see how horrible it is to face fear <laughs> uh, on a daily basis. So, yeah, um, as I said, MS Society please do give as much as you, as you possibly can. And again, we will leave a link at the end of the video yeah. um, just to go in and learn a bit about it yourselves. Yeah. Um, again, I've, I know you don't know a huge amount, yeah. uh, amount about Alzheimer's and dementia, but again, my mum, she led a very, very normal life um, and just ended up through having a stroke that she didn't even realise that she had, uh, she ended up causing the the damage and uh, later found out that she had vascular dementia. Uh, and as a result, again, 
similar to MS, that is one of these things that's a progressive disease. Um, but hopefully things can get stalled. Um, but my mum's at the ripe old age of her mid eighties now, um, and she's she's doing great, survived COVID, yeah. um, and the rest of it. But again, getting back to what it's all about, without the help that we had in the early days, uh, from oh, say, my Scotland, um, if, if life would have been so much more difficult, especially for my dad, um, and for myself, my brothers and sisters as well. It would be, it would have been very very tough going, and it just gave my mum that extra kind of channel to go and meet up with people in a similar situation and in a safe environment and one that is looked after by professionals. Uh, and uh, again, MS Society and Alzheimer Scotland, I can't thank you enough. And this is, as I said, Rachel got me over a barrel. <laughs> For going on Smiler, so it's as soon as she says, "Oh, you need to do this," or these charities that have helped us out aren't going to, well, they'll survive. Yes, but it's yeah. it's nice to get back and for me to face a fear as well, just as my mum and Lindsay faced fears uh, for a number of years. So all I would ask. I know it was very, very tough times for everybody financially just now, but even if you're not able to donate anything at all to the Just Given pages, just go on, have a wee read through about what Alzheimer's is about, what MS is about, yeah. um, because it's it's tough going. It yeah. is tough going uh, for the people that are living with these conditions. And as I said, it'd just be nice for us to give something back. Um, as I said... Unfortunately, I don't have anything for Alzheimer's Scotland at the moment, but I've got a wee thing on the back of our T-shirt. Rachel can... So, this is the MS Society logo and the MS Weekly um, Lottery, and we support both. Yep. Um, and, yeah, th these shirts were made before um, we had put the Alzheimer's Scotland logo. Um, onto the t-shirts however we also support them we do we do so guys as I said we're not making it a, a full life story if you can do anything uh, in relation to donations please do give as much as you yeah. can um, it would be amazing to raise hundreds yeah. of pounds but you know something if I raise 20 pounds it's still getting done yeah. It doesn't matter. Uh, and as I said, we'll keep you updated. Make yeah. sure, whenever you are donating, make sure to leave your name. We'll make sure to give you a shout out. Yeah. And the day that I'm doing it will be the 27th, 27th of May. Yeah. Or the 28th of no, May. Not the 28th, you're doing it on the 27th. I'm doing it the 27th. We but are there for the 27th and 28th in Powers. <laughs> However, you will be doing it on the 27th. I'm doing it on the 27th. But what I would like to do is get some feedback. Do I do it? First ride, do I do it last ride, or know. somewhere in the middle? Yeah. So answers below would be magic. Yeah. And as I said, guys, thanks so much for listening uh, to our wee appeal. Um, I would just like to point out a few things just before we wrap up. Um, that the Just Given page, none of the money raised goes directly to us in any way, shape or form. It goes direct to the charity. Yeah. And um, obviously donate if you are able to, and if not, please just read about the like charities and um, if you can share any links that we provide just as an extra way if anyone else is able to. Yeah, and education is an amazing thing. Yeah, and it, you might not have somebody directly affected with it, but I guarantee you, friends, family. Yeah. And it, it, they'll, they'll know somebody that has one of these horrible diseases. And, yeah, I think we need to fight the good fight. <laughs> and I would just like to say we will get a reaction from the Smiler. That will be put in um, our vlog um, that we will do on the 27th and the 28th. We'll do two different vlogs. Yes. Um, but we will get your reaction um, yeah. before and after. 
Yes. And yeah. So thank you guys for watching. Please donate if you can. And yeah. Thank you for watching. Take care guys. Thank Bye. you.